Hey, what's going on, guys? What's, uh, it's the last Viking TV. Um, this last bit of information might make you want to stop going to the store and stop going out in public because people like this. There's been a, a, a plethora of, of people that are associated with the um, Aryan Nation, Aryan Brotherhood. Um, they're, they're a white supremacy group. Um, I, I've heard about it on the news, um, that they've been, uh, that they've been trying to go on out and, uh, cough in the faces of cops and, uh, and sneeze and, and, and wipe it wherever there's a Jewish person at, they're going to go and cough in, in, uh, Jewish synagogues, stuff like that. Um, so, and in churches and, uh, they don't even go to those churches, but they're going to be showing up coughing and sneezing. Uh, to infect people in the churches, in the synagogues, specifically Jews, um, and cops. If you're a cop, you definitely want to be on the lookout. They'll be pulling down your mask, coughing in your face, stuff like that. Um, and uh, so, yeah, you want to make sure that you're protected. Um, my next video uh, is and a couple other clips are going to be of people actually that have the COVID-19 virus and are purposely spreading it. Um, there are several people that um, that have this mentality of if I've got it, you're going to get it too. And they don't care whether you're old, whoever gets it, gets it. That's the way they see it. And so this is the type of, and, and, and they're using it as basically an attack. These are people that just like to fight. These are people that just, they, they're cold-hearted, evil people, okay? And uh, as long as these people live on this earth, bad things will continue to happen. Bad things will continue to happen. And you've... If you haven't come to the real realization right now that there is obviously a good and an evil in the world, there's only two sides, whether you're good or you're evil, which also gives fact and claim to heaven and hell. If there's a good and an evil and you can come to the realization of that, if there's not a good and evil, then I don't know. Maybe everything's just good and you're just living in, in unicorn land. Um, but for the rest of us, if you acknowledge that there is a good and an evil, then you've got to acknowledge that there is a heaven and a hell. Some people will go to hell and some people will go to heaven. What you do on earth is going to be accounted for what you do in heaven and what you do in hell where you go and where you stay. My next clips are gonna be of, uh, and it's gonna be disturbing photo, footage. Um, these were taken off of some uh, friends off of uh, clips that I got some video off of and uh, I'm going to be showing that here pretty soon. So uh, please subscribe and uh, share. This is uh, some very disturbing footage that um, it's not violent, gross. It's just what you see happening and what you know is happening. And the purposes of what you see is just, it's disturbing. So um, yeah, here we go. Please subscribe and share. Don't just watch this video and be all like, ah, oh, well, someone else will subscribe. I'll just pass up on it. I'll just watch it. and. You know, watch the next video, watch the next video. Guys, without subscribers, YouTube content creators um, could not survive. We depend on subscribers like you subscribing to our content and sharing our content to be able to get more views. The way YouTube works is they go off of an algorithm. The more subscribers and more views you got, the more priority that YouTube computer system is going to suggest your videos so other people can become aware of that as well. So I humbly ask that everyone that's watching this, please share and subscribe. Thank you for watching. God bless and uh, stay safe.
Here's the next clip. Definitely tested positive for coronavirus. Definitely was asked to self-quarantine for 14 days. 14 to 21 days. I'm asymptomatic. My throat's a little itchy. But other than that, I'm not coughing. I feel great. Nah, ain't no toilet paper. I just look. Um, they say it's highly contagious and not even in public. Obviously, I'm in Walmart. Because I got to eat too. So y'all just got to deal with it. If I got it, y'all going to get it too. Fuck all y'all. That's how I feel about it. Need some orange juice. Need some good old vitamin C. Hey, look, so I've been to a local diner this morning. I'm in Walmart now. I'm going to go check out Sam's Club in Concord. Uh, I've been to track the supply to get dog food. I am positive for COVID-19. And it's not going to stop me from living my everyday life. I'm asymptomatic. So... If you old, if you sick, if you immunocompromised, I suggest you stay home. This is not for the old, it's not for the weak. You ain't got to like it. It is what it is, though. I'm not for nobody. All right, this lady here, you're going to see her come on in. She's tested positive for the coronavirus. She's going to actually get a napkin, put it back in, touch the button. She's going to spit now on the buttons. She's going to spit on those buttons. Spit. 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 And then back away. And now... Another person that wants to use the elevator comes on in, pushes the same buttons, gets infected, and uh, yeah. <laughs>